Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel Microsoft Solutions. In this video, we're going to take a look at how you can create these super cool team slides that move with the morph transition. If you're too lazy to create them on your own, you can also download these slides via the link below. Let's get right into it. All right, I have four different profiles here. The first thing we need to do is ensure these are all the same size. We're going to duplicate this slide and crop every picture to create this little strip. These are already the same size, but if they're not, you can crop them so each is perfect. Then, click Crop and Adjust so that only the heads are visible. The nice part is that PowerPoint provides a guideline. You can see the red arrow indicating that these two are now the same width. Apply this to the rest of the pictures to make them look perfect. Place them a little more in the middle and do the same for the last person. Now, drag all of them to the middle of the slide and group them together. Align and distribute them horizontally. If they seem too tight, adjust the spacing by redistributing them. This will be our title slide. To showcase the first person, duplicate the slide, delete the first person, and replace it with the new picture. Ensure the gaps between pictures are consistent. Repeat this process for each person. For the final person, delete the others, make this person larger, and place their image correctly, and select all the slides. Add the morph transition and preview the result. Remove the extra slide you no longer need. Add your text on the slide. I use the Bright Demo font, a free font with sizes 138 and 96. Customize text for each person, adjusting sizes as needed. Use Bright Demo for titles and different fonts for additional text. Finally, add text for the remaining people. Remember, these names and positions are made up. Change the background to a light blue for a softer appearance. Apply the same background to all images. Thanks for watching. Download the presentation below and see you in the next tutorial. Have a nice day. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel.